All clear at Oconomowoc High School today meant students were back in class. The district saying the building is safe after last week's carbon monoxide leak made nearly 200 people sick. As Lauren Winfrey explains, they still don't know what caused it. After a couple of days of canceled classes and multiple air quality checks, classes at Oconomowoc High School are officially back in session. Buses are back at Oconomowoc High and so are the students. This after days of a quiet campus prompted by a carbon monoxide leak. It's kind of nerve wracking because you never know when it could happen again or when they didn't find the problem yet. Sophomore Angel Sator says she was in the bathroom Thursday when her school issued a medical alert and ordered a mass evacuation of the campus after multiple students reported feeling dizzy and nauseous during a choir rehearsal. My mind was like, how could this actually happen in a school? You know, you think you'd be safe. I mean, mechanical things do happen, but. On Friday, classes were canceled as the district worked with an environment management firm and the Western Lakes Fire Department to test the air quality of the school. Tests continued throughout the weekend until the district confirmed the school was safe to reenter, something several students and parents alike say they were happy to hear after Thursday's scare. Coming back to school, it's kind of all right. I mean, there's some doubt, but I mean, that's with every day. Considering that, you know, there was no warning, I think that they did, you know, everything went as best as it could. And the district says, although it can confirm the air quality isn't abnormal, they say they haven't identified a source of that CO leak. Reporting in Oconomowoc, Lauren Winfrey, today's TMJ4.